Here's your daily sports rush from Sports Not for July 26th, 2024. Welcome back to the Daily Sports Rush from Sports Not. I'm Scott Colbranson, and today we're talking about a hot story coming out of Cincinnati. Jamar Chase is in the building, but is he holding out for a bigger contract? We're taking you there to Cincinnati for all the contract drama. So here's the scoop. Jamar Chase is at Bengals training camp, but he's not hitting the field just yet. Is he holding in for a lucrative contract extension? Coach Zach Taylor says it's part of the plan to ease in the stars. But with Chase set to make just $4.86 million this year, the Bengals need to make a move, especially after Justin Jefferson's $140 million deal with the Vikings. We'll keep a close eye on this one out of the Queen City. Speaking of making moves, how about Dylan Cease throwing the second no-hitter in San Diego Padres history. Cease was unstoppable against the Nationals with a 3-0 victory that had everyone on their feet. He struck out nine, walked three, threw a career-high 114 pitches in a game that included a rain delay. Cease had some close calls, but his defense had his back, especially with some clutch plays in the eighth and ninth inning. Cease's no-hitter is a testament to his skill and the determination of a pitcher despite the rain delay. It's a game the Padre fans will remember for a long time. Switching gears, the first big deal before the trade deadline in Major League Baseball happened, the Mariners. They've made a bold move by acquiring Randy Arozarena from the Rays. With their offense struggling and star player Julio Rodriguez out, Arozarena's arrival could be the spark they need. He's been on an upswing, and the Mariners are counting on him to bring that energy to Seattle. Now let's dive into the Olympics. Paris is gearing up for the most audacious games ever. The opening ceremonies, which begin tonight, will be a spectacle on the River Seine, featuring boats, fireworks, and a display that French President Emmanuel Macron initially thought was crazy. The entire city is getting in on the action with events hosted at iconic locations like the Eiffel Tower and the Louvre. Security is tight with a no-fly zone and elite forces ensuring everyone's safety. The anticipation is building as athletes from around the world prepare to compete. Simone Biles is back, and French basketball phenom Victor Wembanyama will carry home hopes on his towering frame. The stage is set for a historic and unforgettable Olympic Games. All right, that's this edition of the Sports Rush from Sports Not. Do us a favor, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel for more updates like this. Also, check out sportsnot.com for these stories and more as you head into your sports weekend. Stay sporty, everyone. I will see you on Monday.